Hey everybody, this is Kevin Wallace coming to you from Cisco Live, and this isn't a professionally edited video because I'm literally doing it on the floor of the show because some big news just dropped this morning from Cisco. They are revamping their entire certification track. Now, let's break it down. CCNA, first of all. Up to now, you know, we've got the individual CCNA exams. We've got route switch and security and service provider and cyber ops and on and on and on. Well, as of February the 24th of next year, they're going to go, they're going to go away and it's going to be replaced with a composite CCNA exam, sort of a sampler platter of different technologies out there. Now, don't panic. As Cisco says, if you're currently studying for your CCNA, keep going. Because let's say that in five months from now, you earn your CCNA and route switch. What happens February 24th? Great news, you get the new one. You automatically get grandfathered in to the new CCNA certification, plus you get a badge that goes with your certificate to show that you're specialized in whatever area you get your CCNA in. So bottom line is, February 24th next year, the individual CCNAs, they go away. They're going to be replaced with a composite, but if you're currently studying it, keep going. Your existing studies are going to count towards the new CCNA. There's also big CCMP news. Specifically, we know that CCMP route, CCMP route switch right now, very popular, probably the most popular of the CCMP exams out there. Well, it's going to be replaced with something they're calling CCMP Enterprise next year. And there's going to, uh, here are the CCMP exams that we're going to have. Now, I don't have firm dates on this. I haven't seen Cisco announce, announce dates on when these are happening. But the new CCMP certs are going to be Enterprise, Data Center, Security, Service Provider Collaboration, and Certified DevNet Professional. And other big news with CCMP, it's only going to take two exams to to complete any CCMP certification, not five exams like it is now for some tracks. There's going to be a core exam and there's going to be a technology specific exam. So just two exams to get any CCMP certification. I think that is huge news. There's even a little bit of news for CCIA people out there. It's not huge. We're not changing up the tracks that you go down for CCIA. But if you've had your CCIA for 20 years, here's what you need to know. You get to keep it for life. You get lifetime CCA designation if you've had it for 20 years or more. Now, let's see, I got mine in 2001, my first one, and I'm 794. There's not going to be many people this affects, in other words. But uh, if you keep your CCNA active, excuse me, CCIE active for 20 years, you're going to be grandfathered in and you're going to get your CCA for the lifetime. But the big news again, CCNA, individual CCNAs going away February 24th next year. If you earn one, and you have an ex uh, what we'll call a traditional CCNA, you're going to automatically get the new one. So no worries there. Cisco says if you're studying right now, keep going. So that's my encouragement to you. In fact, here's what we're doing for that. Since really for a while now, uh, the CCNA has uh, advanced in the technologies that it covers. I mean, look at the exam today. We cover uh, BGP and uh, IPSLA and all kinds of things like that. Well. In order to cover those emerging technologies, and <laughs> BGP isn't really emerging, but to cover the more in-depth technologies, we kind of leave behind some of the basics of networking, some of the network fundamentals. So what I'm going to be doing later this month, uh, just to kind of get everybody to get their CCNA now and not wait till next year, I'm going to be doing a free course online. It's called CCNA Foundations. CCNA Foundations is going to cover, for 12 hours, it's going to cover the basics of networking in lots of different categories. Well, there's not going to be any configuration, but it's going to be 12 hours of solid theory in a variety of uh, technology areas. And again, you can attend for free. If you want more information on that, just go to kwtrain.com slash ccna hyphen foundations. Again, that's kwtrain.com slash ccna hyphen foundations. Thank you for joining me for this quick up update, and of course, stay tuned. We're going to have lots more updates and news coming out uh, surrounding uh, this. I've never seen a revamp like this in the history of Cisco. This is big news, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed this quick update. More to follow. Sign up for that free training. Check it out at kwtrain.com slash ccna-foundations. Talk with you soon. Thanks for joining me.